Omar Gang. I'm sitting here reading, man. I haven't fully woke up now that I had to brush my teeth, wash my eyes and all that. I was just sitting here reading, man. And I just found out another form that is right in front of all of us, no matter if you're poor or successful, mediocre, whatever, right? That the people that, you know, people use to program people to stay poor and it's the hardest to get rid of and people you watch now is probably still working on trying to get rid of this shit this is how fucked up and deep it is so you know how i talk about this stuff a lot man i know i've rarely posted on this page but y'all gotta remember my, my main priority right now is my main page it's right here boom you know what i'm saying this is my main page right here that's mostly entertainment if you don't care for that entertainment and all that bullshit, don't watch it. Because I'm telling you now, it's not. It's free game here and there on that channel. I cut it down to a minimum. I'm strictly entertainment. You know what I'm saying? I'm always going to speak my truth no matter what. That's why I got this page. And that's why I got some videos when I do end up having deep talks and shit. But let me stop yapping. It's, it's my manipulation. It starts from the job you work at. It, matter of fact, it started all the way when you was born. Your parents is already manipulated. Your parents is already manipulated to be mediocre. That your dreams won't come true. That's the reason why they have a fucking lottery system, bro. It's not that it's not that they trying to get back to the community. It's trying to poison the community. They're trying to make y'all make it seem like winning millions is just pure luck. It's not. Like I said, everything is has a purpose. It's either evil, pure evil, or is it pure good? And all the shit they put in the urban communities is purely shit. It's bad, bro. Think about it. Why the fuck is they giving people millions of dollars? Giving it to them. They're going to make the shit right back. Because they don't know. Because poor people don't know how to invest money. They don't know what a million dollar is. They just know that it's a large amount of funds. And the only thing you give it to somebody from urban community that has no knowledge, that has nothing going on, don't know anything about nothing, he's going to blow it. He's going to give him a fat ass house. He's going to do all type of goofy shit that he don't know nothing about. That's the difference between you winning the lottery and you getting it the earn way. You know what I'm saying? That's just a pure example what I'm trying to say. What I'm trying to say is they poison, they poison your mindset. They don't give a fuck about poisoning you. Yeah, they could kill you. Yeah, they're killing you with the food you eat. But that's just, that's just, that's just a quarter of what they doing to us. They aim it for your mind, bro. Because your mind has the power to do anything in this earth. They limiting your mind slowly, slowly with this entertainment shit, with the food you eat, all this shit. Telling you it don't matter. That's the reason why they teach you you bullshit in school. Because they're telling you it don't matter. They're telling you it don't matter. But the, it does fucking matter. I told my little brother. I said, I'm not giving you. I'm not giving you. You're not getting into this entertainment game. This YouTube shit. This streaming shit. Until you graduate high school. And it's not that they teach you something in high school. It's all about. It's all about the principal, bro. You there, you might as well learn a little something. They will teach you a little something. You might. Mainly math. That's the only thing they really gonna really teach you. But you can learn more about reading. Never know. You feel me? That's the reason why they try to teach us bullshit in the school, bro. Because they want y'all to just throw it away, say it don't matter. In which, in which it doesn't matter. I'm not saying it matters. That's just a sheer example, bro. Again, look back. Think about a time that in urban communities, the schools you go to, the open gyms you go to, it don't matter what, nigga. The restaurants you go to, think about it. Why is everything so consistent? Why when you go a couple blocks down, it's the same, it's the same chicken and gyro spot, same gas station, same corner store, same drive-through. You feel me? Same grocery store, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Supermarket, little supermarket. It's because they're begging you to spend all your money without even asking you. That's why they put all these poisonous foods in our body that has MSG. MSG is a thing that makes you keep wanting to keep wanting. It's in Doritos. It's in Oreo. It's in all that shit, bro. 
That's why I don't fuck with none of that shit. That's why I don't eat none of that shit, bro. I'm telling y'all, bro. This shit is right in front of our eyes. And these niggas don't care. They telling you. Go online, bro. Look up what, what they what they doing and shit. I'm telling you right now what they doing. I've been through this information, but I'm telling y'all. I'm bringing y'all the tea. Yeah, I'm bringing that a little late. But y'all gotta understand. I only, I only come speak on something if I know it's absolutely 100% a million times true. They're going to kill motherfuckers like Nipsey and Dolph that go back to the hood and get back and actually doing intentionally good. Just because they're not pushing their agenda no more, you're nothing to them. Like I said, if you don't work a nine to five job, they don't give a fuck about you. You're not part of the agenda. You're not helping them. So it's fuck you. Fuck everything about you like an ex. I said that in one of my videos. Y'all niggas stay bust, they woke, bro. They gonna have to kill me, bro, because I ain't shutting the fuck up on none, bro.